What's up, y'all? DCF here. Um, Cowboys, they just beat the San Francisco 49ers in San Francisco. <sighs> Thank God, man, because taking a look at the first half, the first quarter offense was fucking garbage. Uh, the whole defense in the first half looked fucking terrible and a little bit in the third quarter. Unfortunately, I couldn't watch the whole game. Uh, I had to take off at, like, mid-third quarter. Uh, I had somewhere to go tonight, but um, so I had to miss the last bit of the game. Uh, so I just got home. Morris Claiborne, great job by him. Uh, he made a couple great plays uh, on that fourth down, and uh, that interception he had. Uh, it was kind of an easy interception, but that kind of boosts our confidence up that uh, you know, clearly this is Morris Claiborne's best year in the NFL, so hopefully we can see a lot more of those, because I am just, oh, a good job by, um, Anthony Brown, he's doing a great job so far, but besides those two, this fucking defense is so terrible, dude, I just, I cannot even process how fucking terrible this defense is i mean that first touchdown when um that uh that niners wide receiver faked the hell out of barry church gun for the easy score i just <laughs> i was getting so fucking pissed off because this is one of if not the worst offense that the league has to offer and if we could barely stop the 49ers in the in the first half how are we how are we even going to stay in competition for the NFC East up against uh up against the Eagles or <laughs> still be in the game when we go up against the Cincinnati Bengals or the Green Bay Packers From top to bottom, this defense is so fucking terrible. It really... I mean, I guess they stepped it up in the other half of the third quarter and in the fourth quarter because they held them to 17 points, um, which was when I left. It was 14-17 at the time. Uh, Niners were winning. Um, great job by the rookies. I predicted they would have a great game again. Um... Dak Prescott, he got two, he got two touchdowns. Ezekiel Elliott, uh, uh, again, he ran for over 100 yards. I think he got over, a, I think he got 130 in a touchdown. Great job by Beasley. He he had one huge ass play. He ran his little ass down like 50, 40 or 60 yards, you know. But um, great job by him. Uh, great job getting the win. Without Des Bryant and without Lyle Collins, Tyron Smith, uh, Orlando Skandrick, but you know Skandrick, he's really falling off. <clears throat> Des Bryant, <laughs> I, I don't know when he's going to be back. Hopefully, he can be back next week or versus the Green Bay game, but. I love Dez. I want to support Dez. But as of right now, I just I can't fucking stand him right now. Because we gave this motherfucker 70 million dollars. He finally got the Calvin Johnson fucking money that he deserved and <laughs> now all of a sudden he can't help but get injured. I'm sorry Cowboy fans, but no matter what you got, no matter what fucking bullshit excuse you guys pull out of your ass, because oh he's Des Bryant, one touchdown every three games, that's not a fucking elite wide receiver. If that was, if I were to show you those stats and and say that this was Terrence Williams, you would want that motherfucker gone ASAP. But wait, it's Des Bryant, so let's let's keep making excuses, right? I want to see Des succeed, don't get me wrong, I'm a huge Des Bryant fan, but at the same time, he has not impressed at all.
yeah, he got a touchdown last week, but, I mean, week three, and you finally get your first touchdown. But, whatever, that's, that's another rant for another video, which might be coming real soon because I fucking... <laughs> There is so much more I have to say about Dez. But anyways, that's the end of the video. I'll see you guys later this week for my Cowboys and uh, Cowboys and Bengals video. Um, <clears throat> I'll see you guys later this week. Cowboys go 3-1. and one. Great job, I guess. Um, hopefully we can stay in competition versus the Philadelphia Eagles for the NFC East. And <laughs> I was going back and forth and uh, watching the Redskins game. And, man, they, they damn near lost. Like, it was, it was pretty close throughout the game. I was going to say, if they were going to lose to the Browns, like, holy shit. <laughs> but anyways, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys somehow enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. And peace.